In this episode, Samantha tries to avoid the infected as she continues her journey south. In this world turned graveyard, every footstep is a calculated dance between life and death. I've become a wanderer in a land of ghosts, driven not just by the need to survive, but by the hope that my family might still be out there. I move with caution, weaving through the ruins of cities and the skeletal remains of once vibrant communities. The journey is a solitary one, and the road home is paved with uncertainty. But the possibility, however faint, that my family endures becomes the unyielding force driving me forward. Okay, welcome back to the story of Sam. We left off leaving Topolin, and we got in this house here, and I had to go through and really uh, take a good look at the loot and make some hard decisions. And real quick, here is what I decided to do. Of course, I'm keeping the SK-5966. I really love that it's a 10 shot and it's an internal mag. We're going to keep the Mosin and that PU scope will go on to that, that gun there. And then I decided for the submachine gun, just because I have the ammo, I have to keep the Scorpion because that's the ammo I have the most of. And I have uh, mag, I mean a suppressor for that so we're going to keep that but i got cleaned up a lot of stuff let some stuff go and then uh we're going to move on down the road here but before i do that i want to get to some of the comments in the last episode we talked about my question was what was your favorite zombie or your favorite um whether it's a movie or tv series and we got some uh, good comments so let's just go through that real quick and forgive me if I say your username incorrectly. I'll do the best I can. So at a quiet monk, uh, he said he thinks that his favorite is going to be the original Dawn of the Dead. Um, he says the isolation in the mall and how it all falls apart. He says uh, he does like Snyder remakes, which I do like Zack Snyder too. Uh, but it's common as I'm movie shouldn't run. Oh, this is a good point that a quiet monk makes. Like in 28 days later, the zombies are infected and they're real fast because they have the rage virus. They're not necessarily zombies. Um, and he says, even in disease, they say it isn't zombies. And I, I believe that. I heard that they're infected. And I used to call them infected instead of zombies. But I think it's natural that everyone calls them zombies. All right. Um, oh, yes. Thank you, a quiet monk. Uh, and... Um, at which 199 said that the canteens cannot be fixed, which I've been trying for three episodes to fix the canteen. Apparently they cannot be fixed. All right. So, uh, at Bill NWA 2250, Bill NWA 2250, does that mean Bill in Washington? Is that what that means? Bill NWA 2250, Night of the Living Dead, the original version is his favorite. At 1HT4MI says Lucio. I can't say the name, F-U-L-C-I, 1979 Zombie Flesh Eaters, and then George Garou, 1974, Let Sleeping Corpses Lies, are his favorites. At Tom Wells, 44-49, Dawn of the Dead also, so there's a couple of Dawn of the Dead. Um, he says to keep the Mosin SKI, that's funny, that's exactly what I kept uh, at Tom Wells, I kept the Mosin SK. All right, uh, at Kale012377 says Last of Us, the TV series. That is, I, I enjoy that too. That was great. Um, I can't wait to see what's going to happen to season two, but the first season was really good. So that was very enjoyable. I think it was, it came out on HBO, right? Yeah. And that's a, you know, a, a remake of the game. All right. Um, and at Tomorrow Call says Army of the Dead with uh, Batista. That was, I believe, in Netflix. That was good, too. That was uh, pretty crazy. They all got together and they went into, I believe it was Las Vegas, right? Where the town was taken over by the zombies. And they had kind of like their own hierarchy and their own, you know, established village there. So that was pretty good. All right, I appreciate all the comments. Now let's get back here. And we're going to run down the road. And I'm going to go back to first person. And we're gonna we're still too we're still too close to top one. So we're gonna head down. Oh matter of fact, there's the sign. We're actually leaving. See you later, Topolin. Alright. Let's make sure 
Yeah. All right. I'll make sure that I was recording. I have done that before. I have started and realized that I wasn't recording. Let's eat some food while we walk down this road. Can I not? Can I open it with that? Yeah. All right. My next question will would be, I was thinking about this, and I think it's a good question as we sit here and eat food. So, if you were in the Daisy world, the zombie apocalypse, and you can see you have to eat whatever you can get your hands on. Food is very scarce. But you ran up to some scenario where you could have any meal you want. Say you ran into a group of survivors and they had a professional chef that was in their group. What would be your, your requested meal? What is your favorite meal? I'm sure it wouldn't be sp canned SpaghettiOs or baked beans. Uh, so I'm trying to think. Well, that's a hard one. So if I was in the zombie apocalypse for a long time, what would I want? I think I might want really like chicken parmigiana or a big plate of... Uh, yeah, I didn't know that would be chicken parmigiana with garlic bread. That might be what I would go for. So leave in the comments, what would be your one requested meal? Now, if I'm the one that's going to be the cook, then we're going to be eating warmed up baked beans because that's about all I can cook. Okay, we're going to head this way and I am going to go to a town called... Man, I don't remember what it's called. I don't think my map will say it, will it? Let's look at our map real quick. This map is so hard to look at. Okay. So we, ca we crossed the river. We went to Toppolin. Now we're going this way. All right. This is the town. It's hard to see. It's called... It starts with a Z. Zelis? Zelisi? That's where we're going for. I don't think it's too far. And I'm not for sure if it is a toxic zone or not. So we're going to have to... Keep an eye out if it's a toxic zone. What do we got over here? Nothing? Think there's anything in this old house? Sometimes there can be some ammunition. There's a stove right there. Or an oven or whatever you call it. Yeah, stove. Fireplace. I would come there and cook if you need to. Alright, I didn't see anything in there loot-wise. Who's coming after me? Oh, there they are. Just out here wandering around. Looked like you were out for a jog. Out for a jog and didn't make it, huh? Sorry about that. All right, we're going to move a little bit off, not exactly dead center in the road, because you are pretty visible if you're right dead center in the road. Let's take a look at my stamina. See, I still have too much stuff. If you look at the bottom left, that's horrible. I'm, I'm going to have to uh, change out the backpack to something maybe lighter. Pretty good weather. I don't see any clouds yet. We'll have a nice little jog as much as my stamina will allow me. How much? Oh yeah, I did go through my ammo. See, that's why I had to keep that scorpion. I have a whole nother mag with the 20 rounds. And I do I have a badly damaged. Oh yeah, I forgot I have my little MK in my holster. So, I think, well, I've been waiting and waiting for this Moza, which I'm very grateful for. Since I do have the SK-5966, I'm thinking if I do come across a Tundra, I'll switch out the Moza for the Tundra. 
Which way does that go? Is this the way? I think this is the way. Well, we'll find out at the end of the rainbow here. If you haven't uh, seen it yet, I did release a new video um, and it's called Builded Banter. And basically what I'm doing in that and this series of videos of the Builded Banter one is we're, we're kind of just staying off the grid uh, in that one. And we are trying to stay away from people fights, trying to stay away from zombie fights. And we're just going to have conversation as I build up on my base. I'm working on building a base. I found a nice little pond and I'm gonna you know it has a little shed there already and it has a place to fish next to lots of trees so uh, check out build and banter and in that first one uh, we were talking about Denzel Washington movies so I really like Denzel Washington movies so we were ranking my top 10 sure hope I'm not heading to nothingness hope this road leads to somewhere Uh oh, deer stand. Okay, remember the road is right here. We got to go to the deer stand. Because even if I do get lucky and find a tundra, I need a hunting scope. And that would be the reason I would switch out the Mosin for the tundra is because of the scope. Hunting scope is just really, really good. here oh I do need more of those let's that's good just taking a quick look while we're up here I don't see where I'm place we're headed for yet I guess I probably should drink some water out of my canteen that will not ever refill do I not have a canteen anymore what do I do with it oh there it is Looks like we're going to have to replace the canteen, too. Yeah, I spent, I don't know how long I spent trying to figure out how to fix that thing. I hope they do that in a patch update. If you can fix almost anything else, you should be able to fix that canteen, right? Alright, so if this video goes out for those that are keeping up, we're only like a week away from this total eclipse that's going to be coming. Do y'all keep up with the total eclipse? If you haven't, to if you can't tell by yet from my accent, I do live in the state of Texas. So it's going to come right through where I live. It's coming right through us. All right, so there's something down there. And the road that goes that way. Let's go check this out. Some of these uh, country houses can have tundras and ammunition. I just don't want to get turned around. Remember, the road is back this way. I, I got to get a compass, too. Is that a campsite? Did we stumble across a campsite? That's a shed. No, that's, a, that's one. It's a lone, the lone camp, right? Nope. How many do you see? How many infected do we see? I see one. This is a camp. Let's go ahead and take this one out. If I can sneak out. I'm kind of coming from the side, so I don't know if I'm going to sneak up on him. Nope. No sneaking. What am I 
What is he wearing? Is that Hunter outfit? Well, a gun cleaning kit. I do have a good one. I don't know that I need another battery. I definitely don't need that holster. Let's see what we find in this campground. I didn't even know we were going. Oh, look at that. It's damaged though, but we're definitely keeping. Uh, right when I said, if I find a tundra, I need a scope. And there's a scope. And we can't. Oh, wait. Well, I got two things to fix it. All right, what else? Any ammo? Chain mail. Don't need no chain mail. Is there more stuff going that way? There's a nice big fireplace in this one. It'd be a good place to cook. Don't need that though. Barn over there. Glad we found that scope. I do feel like I've gotten turned around though, because I know that way I was headed should have been where we needed to go. What I don't know is where this goes. Unless this is the outskirts of where I actually wanted to go. Maybe it is. I'm sure there's a lot of houses here. Maybe this is where I need to go. I thought I was going to get lucky and just, uh, I found the scope. I said, oh, I found the tundra. But no luck. Okay, infected there. I wonder if this is the town of Zalis, or Zalisti. Or did I stumble across another place I don't know about? A damaged, what is my MK? Where is my, mine is worn. Let's see if it's got any ammo. Nope. Gotta watch out too. I don't know if this is an actual uh, toxic zone or not. I wonder if I can find a sign. Always helps me if I can find a road sign. There's two more infected. There's a backpack. There's an outhouse. Uh, do I have it? Oh, yeah, we'll fill up this little bottle of disinfectant. Oh, what's this ammo? What is it? 762 by 54, which is what the Mosin. Thank you. Is that the only, that, that's the only 762 by 54 I got? Let's see. Do I have any ammo? I have one shot in it. How many does it hold? Five shots. So there, I got me some Mosin ammo. Well, if we got five shots, let's load up five shots. No, is that it? Did I use up my ammo? What did I do? Oh, was there only like two? Okay. Stand up. All right. Oh. Oh man, I've got so many of those. Uh, see, I don't need this. I've got three. Well, I can't help myself. 
I like those wet, uh, those sharpening stones come in so handy. Why is there no sign telling me what town I'm in? This is affected right there. There's that one over there. Uh, there's quite a few infected over here. Look, one, two, three, four, five. We're gonna get in a mess of infected if we don't watch out. Well, it might be easier to go this way. I only saw one. Oh my gosh, look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six, just on that road there. Yikes, I don't need to go that way. We're just gonna have to go around. Ooh, there's a big chest, nothing in it. There's that one over there. Let's cut across through here. See if there's less to deal with. See? Oh, there's a sign too. Be able to tell if I'm where I want to be. Driver, I don't need a screwdriver. There's a medical. How we how we doing on bandages? Oh, we don't have any bandages. Maybe we should go see if we can find a bandage. This is it. This is the one I was looking for. How do you pronounce that? Zalesi? Uh, Zalisi? Zalis? Zalis? Don't say the word E. Letter E. Okay, so there's medical up here. There's lots of infected so let's see if we can carefully maneuver our way up here and we'll at least go through medical what else we can get through I've never even used the medical thermometer. What is it used for? Ooh, what is that? Look at that. It's a first aid kit. Do I have room for a first aid kit? It's more bandages and stuff. Oh, that's so big. Yeah, we're going to have to do something. Yeah, that's too, that uses too much space. Okay, there's, that's really what I wanted, is to, okay, a blood collection kit, an IV starter kit, a blood test kit. I guess those are all good things to have if you need to redo your blood. Can I got, put that bandage in there? Okay, we'll deal with that later. Coding peels and I really is that is that just to help you when you're sick, right? Which one's better? Coding peels is a painkiller. Broad spectrum antibiotics. Okay, let's take the antibox. All right. I can see one, two, three right here. Anything good in this barn? Nope.
What else is in this town? It's a medical. I think it has a water source. So it'd be good just to try to fill up our water. There's a garage. the yellow house oh a market we need to go to the market definitely that's where you can find scopes too even though I found a scope but I want to check it out I could find one that doesn't need repairing this is like can't you can you put a battery in this and you can talk to it talk out loud so we're allowed to be Is that coming for this town? I just heard a bomb go off for a toxic zone. Is that over that way? Or is that just clouds? Just gotta keep, make sure it's not gonna be this area here. I do not have a mask or anything. house has been emptied. All right, well, let's look over here real quick. Yeah, some houses that could have some ammo. There's a church and then here's the market. Two infected there. Close enough. Sometimes you're not you're not close enough. You won't kill it. So I'm not close enough. Oh my gosh! I can't stand missing easy shots. How's the uh, suppressor? Oh, that's got an internal suppressor. She's kind of out dancing. She needs to be still. There you go. I just guess I wasn't close enough. Can you get into the church? No, I want to get into the market. church got a puffer jacket is that it where's the water source is it right over here how many bullets okay Two over there. All right, anything good? We made it to the market. Got a flag and we got some 357 ammo, which I do have some. We'll add to that, even though I don't think I have a weapon for it. Oops. Oh wow, I have lots of 357 ammo. Okay, 
Okay. So the market didn't have a whole lot. attention to another one I just don't know where it's at oh there it is we'll see let it run around for a minute and I'll reload it's worn I got plenty of 380 too What I need to fix that other mag now that I got two gun cleaning kits. So let's put that there. Take this mag. Let's fix it. Sure hope a toxic thing doesn't drop right now. Okay, it's damaged, so let's fix it again. Okay, now it's worn, so that's good. Let's uh, go ahead and load it. Now we're ready to go. We have two. We have a two mags that are ready to go. Where you at? Look at that. Did I, did I draw their attention, or they're just, oh. Look at all those. That's weird that when I aim down the sight, it makes me shorter than when I'm looking at it right here. That's funny. Maybe I should go around backside at him. So explain to me how I missed that shot. Because he was walking? Is that how I missed the shot? Missing those shots. All right. Well, we did get some stuff at the medical. Not nothing really at that market. So let's keep working our way this way. We got to check these houses, and maybe we'll find some more ammo, and you know, get lucky to switch out for a tundra. Nothing in there. Let's take a look over here. Let's go ahead and go to these houses. Just heard a bomb again. Don't come this way. Nope. I don't need a shotgun. There's the water source. I was looking for that. Ryan Pan. Shotgun ammo. Don't need that. Don't need that.
Let's go ahead and take a drink and then we'll fill up our water. All right, here is Samantha surviving Livonia in some town called Zelis. Surrounded by lots of infected. I haven't seen any signs of people yet. Lots of infected. Let's scoot over here out of the way from those two over there and put this up. Get our gun back out. Well, there's a nice big old tent. Here we go. All right, another infected over there. Looks like it might be getting cloudy, so I don't want to run out of this town yet if it's about to rain. So let's keep looting some houses. Because I, if I get too far from the house, then I'm just going to get soaking wet if it starts to rain. Teddy bear. Nothing in here. A nice fireplace. Ugly zombie dude out there. Pitchfork in the shed. We're gonna head back to this house that's over here. Got here some 762554, which is exactly what that holds. That's for our Mosin. So Mosin ammo I shall take. This little garage here. And I've been doing good at finding nails. I just don't need nails. Not right now. I'm on the move. I don't need it. Look at that. Did I come to Mosin Ammo City? That's perfect. Gotta check cars. I'm, I'm pretty bad at lot sometimes just not checking cars. So I gotta remind myself to check the cars. Here comes the rain. I knew it. I knew the rain was coming. This is just another outdoor thing, isn't it? All right, let's crouch down here, and, get, and we're gonna take a look at our map and give an idea. Exactly where this little sleepy town takes us. Oh, I see exactly where we're going. All right, if we keep heading south, which is the way that we need to go to find Sam's family, there is a camp. There's a, you have this big little pond or lake or not. I don't even know what you'd call it. Um, and then there's a bunch of campgrounds there. Right, so we, there is the diner. Yeah, we came in through the medical, so we just need to keep going the main road south, and we should come across this uh, big water lake pond, and then we'll come to the campgrounds. That sounds like a plan.
Maybe not that way. <laughs> Is it easier this way? Yeah, we came to the garage. That's the way we came. So we need to follow that road. South. And go to that campground. And I... And yeah, I'm not going to fix... Oh, put the map up. Did I just hear a zombie? I'm not going to fix that scope yet until I... If I'm going to a campground... Yeah, there's a zombie there. If I'm going to a campground, I want to uh, make sure there's not another scope. got my scent did he he's cut he acts like he's got my scent but then he's not for sure yeah he's got it Check out this house. <laughs> Do not need that. We can add to our look, we're finding a little bit and pieces of this alcohol tincture just a little bit at a time. We'll fill it up. over there. <laughs> Got a couple of grandmas out here at a grandma convention. The last house, and there comes the rain. Oh, 308. It's damaged, but 308, that's what your Tundra uses. I don't know what else uses 308. I know it's raining, but I think the campground's just down here, so we can we can get to the campground, see what we can find, and we'll stop there and dry off. There's the water. Is this? Did I miss the campground? I'm confused. I just warned that the water campground was on the left. Maybe this is, uh, maybe we don't have a fishing lure. I don't need a flashlight. I can see another structure there. Is this the water that I was talking about? I'm not sure. Alright, just running in Livonia, running in the rain, carrying too much loot. Just another day in Daisy. Well, this has got to be the campground I was talking about.
Nice hunter jacket. Nope, nothing there. A couple of nice hunter jackets, but my jacket's good. All right, we have a left and a right side. Let's say we start on the left and then we come back to the right. And I see one infected. So, means no dead zombies, means no players. Look at that. Look at that. Damage. Okay. So they're both damaged. So I have two damage hunting scopes. So I don't need two damage hunting scopes. I need one non damage hunting scope. Boy, she's tanking him. Got to get headshots or it doesn't work. All right. Well, there'd be some more chlorine tablets to fill that back up. And can I combine? Gun cleaning kit, damage, gun cleaning kit. Yeah, you can't combine those. There's another gun cleaning kit. I really do like that little army pouch. Okay, that's a Prestine. So now we have two Prestines. So, let's switch that out. Two Prestine gun cleaning kits. That is nice. Holster that we don't need. Is these not open? Yes, they open. And yes, there's nothing there. Alright, so that's the left side. Let's work the right side. Look at that, same exact spot. There's another one. Damaged. Every one of them are damaged, so it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna have to fix it. I guess I should have fixed it. Yeah, with the. I should fix it with this gun cleaning kit because uh, why waste my other one? Let me take this damaged one and fix this. Oh, wait a minute. Scope's got to be fixed with the, uh, what is that, like a re uh, electronic repair kit? Yep. Scope's got to be fixed with something else. So it's not like, well then these gun, well if, come on, then give me something to fix this with. It's like a, what is it, like a, some other repair kit. I forgot what it's called. What do I see on that bed? Is that a... There's three scopes in this camp. I found one before I got here. And I've seen at least two. And then now there's one right there. This one is badly damaged, which is worse than the two that I have that are just damaged. These people don't know how to treat their equipment. Twelve gauge, glow pug. Does a tire repair kit fix anything? Oh. Other than tires. Look at that. Look at that. It's worn, but it is the Tundra. And it uses this scope. And look how good this scope is. And you can even zoom in further. I really love the hunting scope. 
Okay. All right, so there's only one problem. Is the Tundra uses 308. I just picked up a lot of ammo for the Mosin. The Tundra. But the 5966 uses the PU scope. So I should keep the Tundra and that. But I just don't have no 308 ammo other than what did I pick up? Two. So I'm definitely going to have to find some more 308 if I want to keep this Tundra. And i got to find something to fix this scope. So, and look at that. Right when I talked about ammunition, 76 by 54 there's a box of Mosin ammo. Kind of like it's destined that I keep the Mosin, isn't it? All right. Mosin is seven. Look at that. That's so nice. Now I've got 20. What is that? Five, 25 rounds of Mosin and only two for the 308. It's always decisions you got to make that not everything's perfect. <laughs> more 76. There, look at that. More 76 Duke 554. It's kind of like life is making a decision for me, isn't it? Looks like I've looted this campground. Did I miss anything, did I? Where'd you come from? Sneaking around like that. You didn't even have anything on you. No other structures past this right here, is there? Okay, well it's raining. Hey, this is where all the tire repair kit took to fix the car. It looks like they need more than tires. All right, it's starting to rain harder, so Samantha is going to get in this place right here, stay out of the rain. And we're going to call this episode right here. Uh, got plenty of Mosin ammo, and now we got a ton, Tundra and two scopes. So we will uh, decide what we're going to do with this gun, which we kind of already know. We've got the Mosin ammo, so what are we going to do? But anyway, this is uh, uh, an episode where we got some good gear, but we're going to head further south, and we're actually getting closer and closer to where she's trying to go, which is basically going to the southeast. And right now we're kind of in... Well, we passed the river, so we're not no longer far north, but we're are we are to the west. So we got to start headed southeast, and that's what we'll do. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and get notified.